boxing on the corner flag. It was just a thing I would have fun mm -hmm. with my friends in Nor back in Norway. But uh, now it doesn't even I don't know. I mix it up. Oh, mix and match, mate. <laughs> like it. Mine uh, was just a spur of the moment thing. Um, me and uh, Juf had a wee bit of previous in the last 10 games in the same season. Uh, so we managed to a few good tackles here and here and wind each other up and just at the time he was right beside me and seemed like the right thing to do. A favourite stage. You can't say a Norwegian one. Celtic Park. Oh. No, it's, it's Celtic Park is good but I also played was the first time I've been uh, when we played now against Inter San Siro. It's a good stadium and uh, also, when we played against uh, France at Stade de France, it was, was a nice stage. For me, I think when I was younger, I went and visited Barcelona Stadium and done the whole walk around the museum and stuff like that. So, to play at the New Cap, I think that's one for me. Got one each. Did you get one each? Yeah. Oh, so, that's a joy. Yeah. I know, big club, eh? <laughs> <laughs> that's what happens. We can afford two of ones. <laughs> F.A. Ambrose, <laughs> Ballador. <laughs> oh, brilliant. We've got a wee group chat going as well. We've got a picture of F.A. <laughs> Ballador standing like that. We keep posting it, but F.A.'s uh, no longer in the group chat, shall we say. <laughs> Charlie. Nah, Charlie's up there. Charlie and him. Yeah, I've never been to America. I will go there next summer probably, but Miami, Las Vegas, New York. Yeah. Just any, anyone for him really. No. <laughs> Mine's is Vegas by a mile. I've been and it was, it was amazing to be fair. Watched a good film yesterday, American Sniper, so I would maybe say that one. Go with the last film. Yeah. I like that. Yeah. It's the only one you can remember, really. <laughs> it's just two minutes down the road for my mum and dad's. Uh, you're allowed a treat now and then. Uh, mint chocolate chip. Choice. You don't even know what that is, do you? <laughs> 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 I've got two main ones. I think the first time I won a cup, I was at Hibs. I got all the lads to sign it. I've got that on the wall. And when we beat Rangers in the cup final, I got man of the match and I uh, got all the lads to sign that as well. And I've got that on the wall too. I used to watch a lot of <laughs> Gazette Italia on Channel 4. And I used to love Del Piero and Baggio as well, the two of them at the time when I was a youngster coming through late 90s and they were pretty much God at the time. Nah, for me, uh, it's a difficult question, but if I need to say someone, I would say Guti in Real Madrid. I think you're going to say you didn't get any channels in Norway. <laughs> you had to just watch your local team play. That's true. <laughs> Probably Neil Lennon, because at the time Tony Mulberry was manager, it was all it was hard, and we had a couple of falling outs here and there and stuff like that. But uh, Neil kind of kept faith in me and kept me going. But then you've got Gordon Strachan as well; he's gave me the opportunity to come to the club and made me Scotland captain as well. So it's a hard one to say, to be perfectly honest. For me, it's probably it's Ronnie. You know, we, I had a tough time. Before I went to Strom Schools and, and uh, he gave me the chance there and and then I went to Celtic under Lenny, I liked it a lot but then he, he came as well so it's difficult to say. My goal against Rangers, 
uh, my celebration at the time and I enjoyed that. Us down to ten men and we were struggling but to be perfectly honest and the lads dug deep in the second half we were the better team and we deserved to get well, to get the draw to be perfectly honest. Yeah, for me I think it's probably when the first time when I went uh, we won the trophy with drum schools and then you you came here and win the trophy and you just had all those two in the so close time to each other, so yeah, that, that will be that. For me, uh, I'd say Rory McIlroy. I love golf and enjoy watching it and it chills me out. I went up to the Ryder Cup and watched him there and the way he conducts himself and the way he plays is extremely humble how good an athlete he is. I like to watch ice hockey uh, and the I think uh, that's a that's the sport I like to watch. So, but it's not nothing like special person I like, to, but it's just a sport. Yeah, I sing the national anthem, but uh, we're all sleeping with it. what it was. Bruno was angry at me at that time. <laughs> <laughs> Came into that and I just sung the national anthem and I got the boo. Then, then it was over. Yeah, I just watched the game against Sweden, and you will hear it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Mine was eight years ago. What did I sing? I can't even mind what I sung. Don't know. It was shocking. Whatever I sung, I am the worst singer ever. Got a feeling it could have been "I'm Too Sexy for My Shirt." Right, said Fred. Just for a wee bit of banter. I can't even mind if it was. Oh.